to explain and tell you why a local police department's involved. How dirty are the phones and anything you touch in a public place? We'll take a closer look in our special report, Derm Warfare. This is News 4 at 10, where the news comes first. Welcome to News 4 at 10, everyone. I'm Kent Bates. I'm Denise Whitaker. Thanks for joining us this evening. They are separated by thousands of miles, an international border and a language barrier, but all bridge for a common goal to fight crime. Bob Clausen tells us it's an international collaboration that landed in Sherwood. Shadowing Sherwood police officer are Fernando Montes de Oca and Ruben Castillo Rolon. They're not from Sherwood, not from Arkansas, not even this country. They're police from Guadalajara, Mexico. The sites they're here to see are community oriented policing procedures. Uh, one of the best things I think to need is to go to the family and go to the school and the community and particip participate uh, together together the authorities, the policemen, and also the citizens. Back at home, COPP is getting the green light from high up. The Secretary of Public Safety and the Governor of the State are working with the same ideas to professionalize the police in Jalisco. Police departments working with each other in the state certainly isn't unheard of, but how does a police department, police department in Sherwood, Arkansas, find itself working with a police department some 2,000 miles away in Guadalajara, and vice versa? Police officer Reggie Koch mentioned the program to police there during a recent trip to Guadalajara. They wanted to know more. They kept me in hours of meetings, asking me questions, asked me to give speeches. I went around and gave three speeches in, uh, in Guadalajara and Tamazula in the state of Jalisco. And uh, then uh, the idea was born, we need, to, we need to continue this one. Made honorary Sherwood police officers, both men realize the city has given them much more than something to hang on their wall when they go back home. Bob Clausen, News 4. Both departments plan on creating an officer exchange program to strengthen Guadalajara's COPP program and to help Sherwood police build a relationship with a growing Hispanic population in central Arkansas.